So first things first, what I want to show you guys or talk about uh, with Loop Elements is we got some some new additions to the interface that kind of make things um, a whole lot more streamlined. So I've been listening to some of the you know user comments, user things. You guys have been hitting me about usability, how you're using it live, all those things like that. I want you to know that I'm listening. I'm always trying to figure out how I can implement certain things. So we have here in the global BPM section right here, and this is the live version. So we're gonna talk about the, the plugin version in a minute. It's pretty much the same features, just minus some of the live things. But uh, now you have these plus and minus buttons on the interface. So if I'm playing a track, I can easily just plus and minus up the BPM, right? Something else that's dope with the BPM is that I can uh, also uh, tap tempo, which is right here. And I can easily one, two, three, four. Now it's been in there since the last update, but I did make some fine tunes to it to make it a little bit more accurate. So you can easily use that and jump up, you know, fine tune it there for what you need. But here's something that's also dope. You can now hold down the shift button while you're holding shift and click and you can type in whatever BPM you want, like 130. Shift plus click 105. You can put in whatever BPM you want, you know what I'm saying, just by doing that. Or you can plus and minus, you know what I'm saying? So that's one of the new key features that we added in on uh, this version or what have you, those the ability, just more BPM controls to be able to add that in. But what's also dope, uh, and this is the biggest part of the update, is swing. All right. So uh, now you'll have down here in the signature browser, a little area where you can change the swing. So I can easily click here. You know what I'm saying? It's crazy. Swing it a little bit more. Maybe we want to go like 80% swing. Let me get it on a loop that you can probably tell a little bit more. Let's go with something churchy. You know, I like church. Uh, let's give me something like this. All right. Let's go down here to swing. And we hit the... Let's try it on a different one. Let's try... Maybe something a little bit slower. Let me turn on my pre preset BPM too. Right? Got a joint like that, right? Let's swing it. We go to the swing. Let's go 60%. It just changes into a whole different loop. Try one more. This is 90s for you. All right. Let's swing this. One click. Yeah. And it swings the entire loop, right? So that's one of the key features uh, that we added in in this update. So you got the BPM, clocking with me. We got the BPM updates where you can plus and minus. You got shift click where you can type in a BPM that you want, like 125, 124. You know what I'm saying? You have tap tempo built in. And then you got swing. So you can swing or what have you. Now, while I'm down here in the preset browser area, uh, we did add in, oh, not preset, but the signature browser area. Uh, we did add in 9.8 as an option for tempo, right? So now you can get like a 9.8 loop. So let's go to something. I'm going to go to something just to kind of show it real quick. Let me just jump and grab like a 6.8 feel. Let me see something like this.
maybe something. Let's slow it down, like way, way down. Right, that's six eight feel. But now we can change that to nine eight. See what I'm saying? So that's like your um I'm probably might be on praise him. Mm-hmm. Praise him. Mm-hmm. Praise him. You know what I'm saying? So now you have nine eight for those who like that kind of vibe. And we got nine, you can even swing the nine eight. So it's the swing isn't just set to um you know, four, four, you can swing six, eight. So let's take that same, that same loop. I can go like, this is, let's go six, eight with a 40% swing. Swing just changes everything. You know what I'm saying? Or let's go a nine, eight with a 60% swing. So you see what I'm saying? It just changes the entire game with that. So those are some new features that we added in with the swing and the BPM and all of those things like that.